New at 11, with every school now constantly looking at new ways to keep students and staff members safe, one company says its product could someday save lives. It says its bullet-resistant doors can turn a classroom into a safe room in seconds. CBS 4's Kerry Codd explains. This is a promotional video for a company called Remo Security Doors. The video shows how the doors will stop a bullet from penetrating the door or glass on one of their bullet-resistant products. It's not really a door, it's really a safety device. Omer Barnes is the founder and CEO of the company. We spoke to him recently over Skype. The idea, the whole concept of creating a safe room, a place where um, kids and educators can hide in seconds uh, and, and be safe. Barnes shared these videos with us. He said once the door is installed, the locking mechanism secures the room and students can sit safely in a hard corner to be protected. Can you walk us through how the technology works? So the biggest component of the door is really the lock, the locking mechanism that nobody can go through the door. If the door even if the door is not fully ballistic, you can shoot yourself in. You can shoot, shoot through the glass as it ballistic and you can shoot at a lock, and if you do shoot at a lock, you're actually gonna jam it. Varn said the doors will stop a high capacity round. So they will stop an assault weapon. Varn said the doors look like regular doors and can be installed in an hour. The biggest issue appears to be cost. He said they start at $2,500 installed. And the question is, will schools remove their existing doors in favor of these ones at such a cost? Barnes believes that school safety has no price. It doesn't come as cheap um, is a $10 fix. But if you look at the result of it, if you look what you achieve by having this product, it's, it's, it's a life changing. Alex would still be alive today if, if Alex's classroom door was bulletproof. Max Schachter's son Alex was murdered at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School. The shooter in the Parkland tragedy never entered a classroom. He shot through the glass into classrooms or in the hallways. Schachter has studied school safety. He believes that classrooms need to be hardened and that if money were no object, bullet-resistant doors or windows would be ideal. However, he believes school security needs to be a broad-based and holistic approach. We've got to look at this way ahead of time to identify children that are exhibiting concerning behavior and get them the help they need and get them off their pathway to violence. Barnes says the doors will lead to fewer scary drills for school children and will reinforce to a potential school shooter that campuses are an impenetrable target. For kids to know and educators to know there is a place they can go to, which is their classroom, the place that they're most, most comfortable in, to know that they can go to this place and be safe is paramount. It's a life-changing concept. The founder of Remo Security Doors says their products are in 40 school districts across the U.S. So could they be coming to South Florida? Well, the founder of the company says he's had several recent conversations with South Florida schools about his products. So stay tuned. In Fort Lauderdale, Kerry Codd, CBS 4 News Tonight.